Well, it is the off season, and during the season while I was hunting this particular farm, I kept thinking, how can we make it better? We always talk about find a better spot or make your spot better. Well, we're gonna try and go into this 41 acres, which is already quite good, and make it a little bit better. Number one, we're gonna plant a bigger food source up top. Number two, we're gonna increase the cover in it by two different methods. We're gonna do some TSI in the draws to increase some bedding, and we're also gonna plant warm season grasses. Number three, we're gonna add one last, one last thing to the recipe, and that's a green food source up here. We already have one down in the hole where they come out. I want another one up here. To make it better, we're gonna do some TSI in this ditch right here. So it's a big plan. I'm excited to see the results, uh, but it's all about trying to make that, that hunting spot a little bit better. So we're inside this little cedar barrier now. One of the things we wanna do is enhance the overall bedding in here. And I think we can do it with about three or four trees by taking these trees and falling them this way into this open ground, it's gonna increase bedding immediately. All of this bedding that we're gonna create is all within 188 yards, and the bulk of it, it's all gonna be within 150 yards. A lot of it's gonna be 100 and in, so therefore, it should really enhance daylight activity. I'm excited to see what happens, especially during the early part of the season. This should be absolutely on fire this year. This is exciting. This week's episode of Deer Season 21, Brother Mark and Wade had a fantastic evening kicking off the Missouri archery season. I could not be happier for those two guys. Forrest and I also had a couple of fantastic evenings that will be shown on next week's episode, so I hope you guys tune in. Thanks for watching. We appreciate everybody out there uh, taking the time to look at it, and uh, please don't miss an episode. Man, finally here. September 15th, we've been waiting for this date for a long time. Since January the 15th. Well, yeah. actually we were late, late to the in Texas, but pretty close. Yeah, it's a, it's a warm one though. It's a lot different than January 15th. Looks like you're on. It looks like you're on too. It's gonna be a fun night. We better be seasons here. <laughs> yeah, I know. Been waiting on this day for a long time. Long time, September 15th. National holiday, or at least a holiday in Missouri. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, opening day of bow season. Temperatures ain't too great to us today, but hey, it's opening day. We're gonna get out there and see what's been moving through. Got some daylight walkers though, so I think you should be in a great sit up there if they get out early enough. We've got some yeah. great MRI on top, and then I'm gonna take a little bit of a flyer, but go to that big old uh, biologic field down in the bottom. We'll see what happens. We're, we're ready to rock and roll, that's for sure. It's gonna be fun. Season is here and we are ready to roll. Let's get after it. Here we go. Our dear Uber has dropped us off. Could be a long set. We'll start with some set. This is curbside service right here. Valet. Take him right to his blind. Wish him good luck. Hopefully he kills that big old five-year-old in here. He's got pictures of it. He can show it to you in the blind. Beautiful, big, heavy tent boy. season opening day it's on first buck in the field at just right before six o'clock early early movement deer cast is saying good and uh, thus far to have a, a deer up on this field this early that's pretty good so i'm excited we got three crews out tonight i'm out mark is out and terry is out so we got a really nice buck that we came in here after it's a 
big 5x5 five five with a shorter G4 on the right. Been getting a lot of MRI of him up on this field, so he's a great deer. And I just hope that, uh, that everything comes together, but I'm excited. Got Josh behind the camera, and I've uh, been looking forward to this day since about late January last year when deer season ended, so it's going to be fun. All right, checking deer cast out here. Today's good, and then you look at what's coming. Look at those highs, 84, 84, 89, 87, 82. So out of the 10 day forecast, we've got two with green. And if there's a time of the year you can get by with a little warmer weather, it's this time of the year during phase one because of the fact that they're used to it from the summer. We're gonna go and we're gonna hunt. We're gonna get after them the next few days. We're never gonna stop hunting and trying, but we'll be wise about which stands we go to. It's one of the reasons we did deer cast. Here we go. Deer season's here. Missouri opener. Terry, good luck. Wade, good luck. Let's put one down, boys. You know, the best spots are the ones with the best access. And in this little creek, we came in the back side of this windrow. Through the little bridge, and then we're gonna go out. There's money right here. Literally zero visibility with the exception of the cloak crawling up the ladder. Boom! 
Boom, baby. Boom. Let's go. Right through his lungs. Went top along. Come out the offside. Right in the middle. Opening night. Opening. I can't even believe it, Carson. Whew. Opening night. I saw him come out, and he was in a blind spot for Carson. So I, I went in and got the pre-roll, and I zoomed in on him, and I said, I think it's a shooter, because I saw his head. I mean, a giant, big old mature Missouri buck. And we just smoked him right here, just past that scrape tree at about, I'd say it was about 20 yards. <laughs> How about that for first <laughs> Welcome to Tree Outdoors. <laughs> Carson's first night filmed. He's been working with us now for about four weeks, maybe. Yeah. Yeah. And Josh and Ben are working on deer season 21. And uh, we just put one down, I believe. Oh, yeah. He had a large head. I knew that. And he's not very wide, as you can tell. That's leaves. This is rack. That's rack. Like, I'm not so sure we didn't just shoot that deer. Look how long everything is. That's what I noticed on him. He's long. And he had a giant head, just like this head. You see it all rising moon. It just never fails. Dear Cass said good, buddy. It was good tonight. A little warm, but that rising moon counts. First south counts. That algorithm picks it all up. Now we're gonna go pick up Wade and Josh. And first thing I'm gonna do is thank Wade, because he set that particular blind. I took one on the other end of the farm, he took that one. Wind was right for his. Thank you, buddy, I appreciate you getting that set up. Man, we love this stuff. I can't wait to tell Terry, Matt, Taylor, Wade, Perry, I'm telling you, this is what it's all about. Northwest winds at eight miles per hour. Pressure is on the rise. Front is moving. Perfect conditions for hot corner. Shooter's been all over the south. Want to focus on afternoon movement. Hot corner, 3 p.m. It's the easiest decision you'll make this season. Get ahead of your game with DeerCast.
my target buck. Opening day. Oh, my heart's racing. He came in. Other bucks were at the scrape tree, and he was starting to make a scrape. And I just put that VXR to work. Boom! Thank you so much, Josh. That was incredible. Did. Oh yeah, we had to have seen 15 different bucks. Did you? Yeah, we saw the short G, saw the short G2 buck, and uh, and, and it's and that it, big heavy body gear. Yeah, the one with the short G4. Is it? Yeah. I'm it is. Oh, <laughs> it's him. Oh, guys. Yeah. Big body. Oh yeah. Yeah, he came up and was working the scrape tree. That's awesome. Right at last. How much fun is that? Oh, it's incredible. That's awesome. It's so much fun. Which one do you want to load first? This one or mine? <laughs> you got one too. Oh yeah. <laughs> what? <laughs> uh, yeah. Dude, doubling up on the no way. Day. Are you serious? You guys pulled serious? a heart attack. That is awesome. Dude. <laughs> oh yeah. That oh, is yeah. awesome. There he is. Yeah. <laughs> There he is. Holy cow, good yes. deal. What an unbelievable opening <laughs> afternoon. I can't even believe it, Wade. Congratulations. It's nice to see this project with an exclamation point at the end of the project, essentially. Yeah. Good job. Thank you so much. You know, like, deer cast said good, but in actuality, the movement was great. I yes. mean, there was deer everywhere. They started early in the five o'clock hour, even. This guy came out early and finally made his way into the deer radishes and to the scrape tree where I was able to make a 25 yard shot. And you, you hit him what people would say, well, he hit him back, but in reality for that body angle, you aim to exit and that's yep. exactly what you did. It literally went through everything. He didn't travel 30, 40 yards and he was down. Yeah. I mean, that's that's an awesome shot. We'll run that through deer cast track and show it went through everything essentially. Yep, that, uh, that vertical pin from HHA that I shoot, I just put that literally right on that front, front leg. And offside. Offside leg and aim to exit and that's exactly there it where is. it hit. That is awesome, man. Congratulations, opening day, and a big old five and a half year old bruiser down here in Missouri. Just awesome. Now we get to go do it again. <laughs> Track job number two. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Congratulations to you too, man. Thank you, man. That victory arrow went all the way through and just poked off the back side because I saw blood coming out the back side, or at least a hole. And then it, when he hit this brush, it broke off. That's a victory 400. I'm shooting 54 pounds with a Rage 2.3 and it did the trick. Oh yeah. <laughs> See that big Rex? Yes. Congratulations. Yeah. Wow. Yes, That's yes, crazy. yes. He didn't go very far. No, he didn't. Oh, uh-oh. Yeah. Uh <laughs> that is something right there, boys. Look at that thing. Look at the head on him. How about it? Look at that. There's that uh, two, three poking at the back side. Well, Wade, that completes the Missouri opener daily double. <laughs> it sure does. And just two awesome, big, old, mature bucks at that. At both of them, five, or I th this one might be six. He's got an awfully big body. And uh, what a start to the season. We've never done that. But I, I said a few weeks back, we shoot them during the season, but we kill them right now. In other words, the work we did ahead of the season, not only where you were sitting, but on this plot here, made a difference tonight on the opener. Absolutely. Over there where I was sitting, you know, we enhanced the bedding all around, planted that taller grass, got them bedding closer, coming out earlier. And here, we just changed the plot completely, planted to our position. We did. Uh, we've sat this field many times on the end zones, east and west, killed big deer down there. But with a bow, they're hard to get within range. Dustin Wiseman sat here last year. He said, man, they're walking down the middle. We need them on that north edge. Wade and Perry put a big radish field along the north edge. Wade pulled that keen outdoors trailer in there. And then tonight he read the script. I mean, he walked right to the scrape tree and gave myself and Carson a shot at 22 yards. And I just couldn't, couldn't tell you how excited I am to start the season off like this. It is an awesome start and I can't wait to see what's ahead of us the rest of the season. Deer season 21 rolling. Well, what a big congratulations to Wade and Mark on opening day in Missouri. Two giants killed and deer season 21 is rolling on. And on the next episode, you're gonna see Terry and Forrest and they have that farm dialed up and I'll just let you go watch it. And there is a lot of deer hitting the ground. 
Doug, Henry, and you might catch this big Missouri deer on an episode in the near future. We are rolling. We're adding new videos every week, so make sure to click that subscribe button and check out all of our amazing content. This episode of Deer Season 21 is brought to you by MOTV. For access to all our Jury Outdoors TV shows, head over to the MOTV app today.